Johannesburg is a great city and it's got a lot to offer, but just a short two hour flight away from there to the southernmost tip of Africa and you find yourself in one of the most beautiful cosmopolitan cities in the world. Everywhere you go in Cape Town has jaw-dropping views of nature and here on Chapman's Peak Drive is no different. With Table Mountain, Lion's Head and Hout Bay in the background, this is also the scene of countless car commercials. It's that good. Of course, the most iconic topographical feature of Cape Town is Table Mountain. But if you don't have the time or the inclination to hike all the way up Table Mountain, then equally as rewarding, particularly for the views, is Lion's Head. Just up behind us, that's where we're heading. Let's see what it looks like from the top. So we've been hiking for about two minutes. We had to take a break. <laughs> so here we are for the WPT little walk up a hill. Actually, it's 669 meters altitude at its very top. Supposedly, it's going to take us an hour. Let's see if I can still speak and walk at the same time when I get to the top. I'm not sure Antonio quite realized that he would be able to summit Lion's Head with all the gear that he was carrying on his person. The conditions were far hotter than we expected and the video camera ended up overheating so it just became a useless bit of burden for Antonio and uh, we were down to pictures for the rest of the hike. Well the hike is deceptively long. I have done it before but the rest of the crew weren't expecting it to be quite as taxing as it turned out to be and at points you're literally climbing up a rock face which has handles and chains drilled into it. Once you reach the summit of Lion's Head, all the pain drains away as you see the most spectacular jaw-dropping 360 degree views. Uh, but what goes up must indeed come down. And it was another hour of painful descent on tired knees and legs. And it was at this point that I revealed to the team that the day was not yet over and that there were penguins to be seen at Boulders Beach in the southern part of Cape Town. We had a great time here in Cape Town. There's so much to do, so much nature, so much beauty. And now we're heading north to Johannesburg for WPT Dietzbach's Johannesburg in the Emperor's Palace. Look forward to it. Hope to see you there. From me, Barney Trouble, the Royal Flush Crew. It's lecker brew. See you later. <laughs>